casa. into the background of it so yeah Just to see where the eye is. Uh, 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 I'm in a dark blue. Yeah. 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 I just wanted to dry up a little bit before I put anything back on it. Couldn't have done that. <laughs> Oh, I should come out of the way anyway, so after that I think I'm gonna get to grab my white. Uh, quite a new can so I've got to shake up a little bit. Yeah. Right on there. Uh third time we'll give it a bit of a blue pink for it, so Stuff. Looking alright. The paint there. Uh, I'm gonna let this dry a little bit, so I'm gonna take it out. Uh, I'm gonna take it out from here. Yeah, I'll take it out to my heat for a second. Dry it up, and I'll just do that too. Hope at least. But yeah, I just need to do that to be able to carry on. I'm gonna put my be very careful of this. Sort of drop it down there. Uh, better for it to be completely dry when I do this, but when I take it up, it hopefully should be okay. This is part where it's going to be quite new for me. I'm going to get a couple of colours and I'm just going to drop the wet. Get a couple of colours, spray them on here. And then it's going to make the flame that we'll get. Uh, a light blue. And dark blue. What the hell, I'm going to make, add in a little bit of a medium to it. To give it a bit of range. I'm going to do it. it. And just do that. Yeah. Clearly not an expert at this yet. <laughs> but getting some cool effects to it. Let's do it again. So that the Whoops. Alright, uh, right blue. Medium. 
the ramps, turn over the paint and I think this technique is perfect for me, but it's probably going to go as I started. Seems a bit stupid to stop. Good try. Keep them down. We'll cover up the moon's planet thing. So, we can get completely. And boom. So, so. Yeah, I think we'll turn this around now actually. Try the rest of it. Sorry if I look like a bit of a pellet down there. Let's get some different paper. Like that. Again, spray. Spray. Blue. I might add a bit of white in it a little bit later. For now, these are the colors I decided to go with. Turn it over again. He's fond of how it's coming out, but I want to see how it goes completely before I get it. I'm gonna add a bit of white into it now. Hopefully, I'll get a bit of a better effect out of it. I have been asking that a bit better. like a, a transparent blue really just uh, gives a sort of a secondary effect to it so it just doesn't look plain and white which I'm going to do now actually
Oh, let's sit down for a sec. So my back is killing me. Actually, I might need to get a bit more weight for the top because it's a bit too blue. Let's just get a bit up here a bit. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go back on this planet and just do quick just to get it wazam. Uh, I think I'm going to add some star sets now actually because it's a little spacey. Spacey like. Uh, I personally like to have quite a bit of stars, lots of, diff lots of different sizes, they look like dots, but... Same time, they sort of make everything look a bit better. So now, done that, I uh, think I might try to dry up a little bit before I finish off the painting. Ne nearly finished guys, nearly finished, nearly there. Uh, actually, you think, what to that actually there? Tint it a bit blue. And now I'm going to add the rest of the stencil. This is just going to be like a pure black just to make it obviously visible. Uh, I'm going to use some of my weights for this because if you don't weigh it down properly then everything just goes to hell really. Oh, nope, I need a small one. One second guys. You know what, I'm just going to hold the rest of the awkwardy parts down with my carrot knife if need be. Yeah, so, going back. Now I'm just going to get it worked. So I know it's just not the back, that's my clear. That I'm not going to use until like right at the end. That's super wet. Uh, there's my back. Right, so wait. I did not screw this up. No, me, there's a good chance I would have. Just to uh, lift that up slowly. Yeah, it's looking good so far. Now, it's got to be careful with this bit. So my face is in the camera then. I don't get right really close, so I'll just let this dry. Yes. Ah, uh, see, I have screwed this up a little bit. My eye was not as dry as I thought. Oh dear, but... Yeah, for a first attempt, it's not too bad. But obviously, I need loads of practice with this. So now, I'm going to... Start. Get a bit clear here. Obviously, I need to get rid of this clear can because it is kind of dying. I'm like try a little bit more so I can actually sign my name. Mm -hmm. yeah. I cannot sign my name with a <laughs> palette knife. Uh, I had a bit of a, a stick here a minute ago. I could sign my name with or how about it. And it's disappeared. That 
It was very unfortunate. There were, I saw my name, name later, get you guys to look at my painting. So obviously you can see where, oh, there a spell. Sort of see where my eye went a bit funny. But the sort of flamey bits at the back, you've got to admit, it's quite good. The first attempt at this, come on guys, give me a break. Oh, I think that's all for me tonight. Uh, go let's dry, I'm going to take it wherever, and then go clean up all my stuff. Have a good night guys.